email without a signature, forget it. Because it screams that you are unprofessional in your career. A signature is a little piece of information that sits at the end of any professional email and tells all you need to know about the sender. So first, let's design it in Microsoft Word, then add a signature to messages in Outlook. To create a signature, I first go to the Office Templates website. I put the link in the description. Download the Signatures Gallery. I scroll the page to find something suitable. You can find your signature sample from other templates. OK, it seems good. I find it. Highlight and copy. Then open a blank word page and paste it here. First, I want to change the photo. You can use your image or the company logo. The company logo is a standard. However, if you are working solely, your photo can sit here. OK, let's change the photo. Right click on it and change the picture. I want to select the image from my computer. So select this device and find the photo. I use the logo of Honamo. Right, it sits here. You can crop the logo or photo by selecting it and from picture format, you can select a crop icon to crop the photo. We can also use picture styles. I just resize it. Now change the name. In this template, name and surname are in uppercase, but I just want the first letters to be in uppercase. Samo Tamhidi. I try to have consistency with my writings and the logo. We can change the color the same like the logo or in black. OK, the following line is the title. I type my title here. Then we have logos here. In company signatures, using Facebook, Twitter or Instagram social media is not common. Anyway, I want to enter my YouTube channel and LinkedIn pages here as links. Again, on the logo, right click and change the picture. I've already downloaded the logos. Double click on the YouTube logo and change the LinkedIn logo. And the next social media can be my Instagram account. Now I want to link all my social media to each logo. Right click on the YouTube logo and select the link and enter the address. I enter PM's point YouTube address here. This time I enter my LinkedIn. And then I insert my Instagram page address. If you have business number, type it here. People can reach you from this number. My email is also the web address if you have. And the address of your company. If you work solely at home and you have a home office, you can write the address of your home here. Or even you can miss it and not write it. I just remove it. And this line is shape. I select it. From shape format, you can change it. 
Now trim your signature. Well, the signature is created in Microsoft Word. Now it is time to insert it into the Outlook. But before I continue, if you are new in our channel, welcome. You can subscribe to learn more. Select Ctrl and A keys from keyboard to highlight the signature. Copy it and open Outlook. Go to File and Options. Here, select Mail and Signatures. I have not created any signatures previously. From Email Account, select S.Tamhidi. Because I've also an info email, that's why I select my own email address here. Press a new and name it. I give it PM's point. And OK. Paste the signature into this blank area. New message is that when I create a new message, shows the PM's point template. What is PM's point template? This is what we have created, and I paste it here. And replies or forwards is that when I want to reply to an email, again use PM's point template. And press an OK. The signature is created. If I go to Home tab and New Mail, you see the signature is here. And if anyone clicks on these icons, the linked page opens. You can also create more than one signature to any of your emails. The best way of creating a signature is creating from the word, copy it and paste it into Outlook. So it is not needed to copy and paste any time your signature. It automatically created when you want to reply an email or create a new one. If you are curious about how to automate your emails, subscribe us to learn more. Or even it works for replies.